guys, my name is Christy Striever and I'm a creative photographer. So I'm going to be doing a portrait shoot today with Vazzy and I've already made um, like this white liquid type paint looking stuff that I'm going to be putting on his hands. I'm going to be showing you guys how to make that. We're going to be working with fabrics. We're going to be doing a milk bath with all these non-toxic paint powders just to make it really colorful and fun and exciting. I haven't done anything before like it, but no time like now. So. Um, I'm, as I said, I'm going to be showing you guys everything behind the scenes and then I'll be showing you how I edit and then the final pictures as well. So let's have fun today. Okay, so in this bowl over here I've got some maizena and then I'm going to add some glycerin and then I'm just wondering, I may need to add paint. So the aim is to do like a white kind of liquidy... So as you can see behind me, I've got my red backdrop set up, or backdrop, and then I'm just using one light. I'm going to get a red hibiscus from the garden, and then I'm going to have the hibiscus on one half of his face. I may put some red paint on his face, um, so that's going to be my first picture. So if there's one thing I've always struggled with, it's trying to get things to stick to me and not fall off. I normally use um, Bostic craft glue, but now what I've got on my hand here is some double-sided tape and I've just tested it, it actually works really well. Um, it is a bit sore when you're taking it off, but and the scorpion's tail is broken, I'm just going to show you. See, so it can sit really nicely and I don't have to worry about it falling off. I'm going to be using lots of double-sided tape in the future. I think my skin is going to hate me. Um, and you'll see how Buzzy feels about having some double-sided tape on his face because I want the scorpions to be on his face like that. And I think it's going to be ooh, it's going to be pretty sore getting this off. My next shoot, what I'm going to be doing, is getting bandage and putting it around his, his eyes like this. And then I'm going to get cotton wool towards the end of it, put it over and then wrap the bandage over it. Using it's, it has spilt a bit, but this is black gel food coloring. I'm going to be putting that on top of the cotton wool, and then I'm going to be sticking the scorpions onto him using some double sided tape. So another thing I did at last minute, I'm not sure I'm actually going to push for this picture to be done. So I just got this brown paper that we got in a take a lot order. Um, so it's all scrunched up and it looks quite cool so I stuck it there. And then I'm going to use that white um, paint with the cornflower and everything and I'm going to get the whisk. I'm just going to flick it across him so the paint flicks across him and across some of this. And then I'm going to make like a brown paper. Um, I don't even know what's around him that will also get the sprays on it so I think it's gonna look really edgy and unique at least I mean it's I can see it on Pinterest which is great so it's a fresh idea hey guys this is Vazzy so he has been an amazing model and I'm gonna be putting paper around him now and just making like a little I don't even know what <laughs> I did. <laughs> like, I think Christy is like dope. And the nice thing about working with her is that she knows exactly what she wants. <laughs> So 
Mazzy, how are you doing right now? Um, I'm good. I'm putting my entire trust in you. Entire trust. Be <laughs> Hopefully they will be. Good yeah. job. It's pretty Paint cool. All over me, but that's all cool. over. It's just all over. <laughs> all over. <laughs> Sienta me 